Hello students, in this video we shall discuss question number 6 of exercise 2.4. Write the following cubes in expanded form. So this cube we need to write in expanded form. For this we will use the identity a plus b the whole cubed is equal to a cubed plus 3a squared b plus 3 a b squared plus b cubed. So 2x plus 1 the whole cube is equal to here a is 2x and b is 1. 2x the whole cubed plus 3a squared. 2x squared b plus 3 2x into 1 plus 1 cubed. Now we will simplify this. This is to the power of 3. So 2 to the 4, 4 to the 8. 8x cubed plus 3. Power of 2. 2 into 2 is 4. So 4x squared into 1 plus 3 to the 6, 6 into 1 is 1, so 6x plus 1 cubed is 1, 8x cubed plus 4 3s are 12, 12 1s are 12, 12x squared plus 6x plus 1. And we shall check if this is in standard form, that is decreasing order of the exponents. 3, 2, 1 and here it's a constant. So this is our final expanded form. Second one, 2a minus 3b the whole cubed. The identity we will use is a minus b the whole cube is equal to a cubed minus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared minus b cubed. This is very much similar to our formula a cubed plus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared plus b cubed. The only difference is here there is a minus and here is a minus. Minus plus minus. Now we shall expand it. Here a is 2a, b is 3b. So 2a cubed minus 3 times 2a squared b is 3b plus 3a is 2a b is 3b the whole squared minus 3b the whole cubed. And here I forgot to put a square. This should have been a b squared. So 1 squared which is 1. This answer will remain the same. Just put a 2 here. I just missed out this 2. We will simplify this. 2 cubed. That means 2 into 2 into 2 is 8. A cubed minus 3. 2 to the 4. So 4A squared into 3B plus 3 into 2A. 3 3s are 9. 9B nine squared minus 3 to the power of 3. So 3 3s are 9. 9 3s are 27. 27b cubed. That equals to 8a cubed minus 3 4s are 12. 12 3s are 36. 36a squared b plus 3 2s are 6. 6 9s are 54. 54ab squared minus 27b cubed. Rearrange the terms. Write the cube terms first. So 8 a cubed and then minus 27 b cubed minus 36 a squared b plus 54 a b squared. That's our final answer. Third one 3 by 2 x plus 1 the whole cubed. Here we will use the identity a plus b the whole cube equals to a cubed plus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared plus b cubed.
Here a is 3 by 2x, b is 1. So a cubed is 3 by 2x, the whole cubed, plus 3a squared is 3 by 2x squared, b is 1, plus 3 into 3 by 2x, 1 squared, plus 1 cubed equals to 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 27 over 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 x cubed plus 3 into 3 3 is a 9 and 2 to the 4 9 by 4 x squared into 1 plus 3 3 is a 9 so we can just write here 1 squared is 1 so we can just write 9 by 2x plus 1 cubed is 1 equals to 27 by 8 x cubed plus 9 3 is a 27. 27 by 4 x squared because that's multiplied by 1. So 27 by 4 x squared plus 9 by 2x plus 1. This is in standard form. Exponent is 3, 2, 1 and constant. So that's the final expanded form. First one is x minus 2 by 3, y the whole cubed. So here we will use the identity of a minus b the whole cubed which is a cubed minus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared minus b cubed. a is x, b is 2 by 3y. So x cubed minus 3a squared. So x squared into 2 by 3y plus 3 into x into 2 by 3y squared minus 2 by 3 y the whole cubed. Simplify this. x cubed is x cubed minus 3. 3 cancels out. Left with 2 x squared and y. So minus 2 x squared y plus first we will square it. So 3 into x 2 to the 4, 3, 3 is a 9, y squared minus into 2 into 2 is 8, 3, 3 is a 9, 9, 3 is a 27 and then y cubed equals to x cubed minus 2 x squared y plus 3, 1 is a 3, 3, 3 is a 9, cancellations, so that's 4 by 3, and then x y squared minus 8 by 27 y cubed. Now we will write both the cube terms together. So after x cubed we will write minus 8 by 27 y cubed minus 2 x squared y this one plus 4 by 3 x y squared. So now we have arranged all the terms and this is our expanded form for part 4. So that was question number 6. In the next video we shall do question number 7. Thank you.